Hello, Governor, and welcome to Game Champo. I'm Doug Zyder Rose, and we're here to talk about Assassin's Creed Syndicate. I also suck at accents, so I'm going to stop now. So, oh, now the Assassin's Creed experience has returned to San Diego Comic Con again this year. If you are one of those who has pre ordered the game or pre ordered the game here at the convention, then you get this fancy hat. On the front, it talks, you know, it has the Assassin's Creed Syndicate. On the back, it's got the logo. So, for your ordering, you also get these foam brass knuckles, which you can actually bring in your carry-on. Revel in it. And you are also given two temporary tattoos. One says Rooks. It's the gang of Jacob and Evie Fry in the game, as well as uh, the icon of the game. Um, okay, enough about the free swag. Let's talk about the course. So, there were a total of seven obstacles that you needed to conquer to get through it. First was the rope wall or the war pole. Rope wall, seriously, you can run up that thing if you know what you're doing. If you're less concerned, I still recommend the rope wall because there's a rope. If you are confident in what you're doing, there's the warp wall. Just get a running start or when you or at, at second to last step, or you're not sure if you can pull it off, jump, grab, haul yourself up. This leads to the zip line. Line, grab the handles, ride it straight across, let go. Oh, part three, hot shot. You're given essentially a blunderbuss with a tennis ball in it. And you need to aim for a plaque with the assassin's logo on it, hit that, drop the bag of bricks, you need to start running. And that leads to the, uh, pendulum, no, no, that's not the pendulum swing, that is the alleyway. The alleyway is a two-part obstacle. The first consists of a tic-tac. You need to jump from one side to the other. You can do it in a couple hops if you're really good. Uh, or you can just run from one side to the other. It's a lot of fun. The second part of that is something straight out of American Ninja Warrior, where you literally to support yourself between two walls. So they do have these little slats that you can catch yourself on with your feet. Okay, that took a lot of effort. All right, the absolute hardest one that everyone was having trouble with was the cargo net. You need to uh, grab a swing, swing over to the cargo net, grab it, and then climb on the underside of the cargo net without touching the ground, and there is very little clearance. That's the tricky part. The last part is the train dash. After a little scaling up, you need to run across a rotating platform. Um, some people might actually be able to jump it or call how you want to approach it. Like any good uh, jam, just think about it as you go along. Alright, that's the quick summary of what uh, you would find at the Assassin's Creed experience at San Diego Comic Con 2015. And thanks for watching the video. Please be sure to like and subscribe and keep up to date all our Comic Con coverage. Thanks.